setting and achieving goals. Let's get started. So the first step to achieving your goals and your dreams is to actually set them. And there's a lot of good YouTube videos out there that explain exactly how to set good goals, but I'm gonna save you some time. 95% of it can be boiled down to three things, an objective, a metric, and a deadline. So for example, if you wanna lose weight and be healthier, then your objective would be to lose weight, your metric would be pounds probably, and then you would set a deadline of let's say three months. So your goal would be, I want to lose 20 pounds in three months. Now I want you to pause this video right now and using this framework, set a goal for something you want to accomplish. Or if you already have goals, then maybe rephrase it in terms of these three things, an objective, a metric, and a deadline. Go on, pause the video, I'll wait. Okay, now that you have your goals, you want to actually achieve them. Uh, what you don't want to do is setting them and then forgetting them. Um, about a year and a half ago, I had set a goal where in one year I wanted to make $1,000 a day. And I wrote that down and I kind of just let it sit there and didn't really take action besides Googling how to make money like a few times. And it takes more than that to make $1,000 a day. So don't be like me, you want to actually take action to achieve your goals. So goals are a way of outlining what you actually want to achieve, but they don't tell you what you need to do to achieve them. So that's where systems come in. So what are systems? Systems are things that you do consistently to work towards your goal. Winners and losers usually both have the same goal, but what differentiates them is their systems. A gold medalist in the Olympics and someone who placed last in the Olympics probably all had the same goal, but their systems are what set them apart. So how do you actually find these actions that you have to do in order to accomplish your goals? Um, and step one is to break your goal down into a to-do list. Most goals will have actions that need to be repeated regularly for you to achieve those goals. So back to the weight loss example, you're gonna want to exercise and also eat healthy, and then you're gonna wanna keep doing that over and over again until you see the results. So to reframe that into a system, um, you might say you're gonna go to the gym three times a week on Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and every meal you have, you're gonna have a portion of protein and vegetables. And so you achieve your goals through the results of these actions compounding day after day after day. So after you've figured out what goals and what your systems are gonna be, you're gonna want a way to regularly check in with these to see what progress you're making. And so that's where goal check-ins and reviews come in. So every week or so, you're gonna want to check in with your goals and adjust your systems accordingly. And you essentially want to work this into your systems to make this a regular occurrence as an action that helps you work towards your goal. So choose a day of the week, maybe like every Sunday or every Saturday, you're gonna wanna take out a piece of paper um, and a pen. Uh, online document uh, is okay as well, but paper and pen is better. And you're gonna to wanna to ask yourself these four questions. One, what's going well? Look back and see what you're doing well and what's helping you make progress towards your goals. Um, obviously, these are things that you wanna keep doing. And this is also a way of positively reinforcing yourself to keep doing this thing so you can keep working towards your goal. Two, what's not going so well? Why? Here you wanna identify what's wrong with your systems and how you can adjust them to improve them. Three, refresh and revise your goal. This step is usually for after you've worked on your goal for a bit and in case you want to refresh or revise your goal to meet your needs or maybe take into account any new objectives that you want to accomplish. Four, how can you improve these results? Identify action steps. This is definitely the most important step. Here you want to literally write down a list of things that will get you closer to your goal. And so this kind of goes back to the to-do list for your goal that I mentioned earlier. Um, it's kind of like breaking down your goal into, I guess, a list of actions that you need to do. And kind of in complement to this, you also want to write down a list of important tasks that you want to complete before your next goal review next week. And finally, make any appropriate changes in your systems that will help you do better the following week. So again, write these questions down and write these answers down. Um, online document is okay, paper and pen is better, and you want to repeat this for every goal that you set. Finally, the daily journal. 
Grab a pen and a notebook and every morning you're going to want to write down the date, write down your goals, and then write down what you're going to do today to accomplish your goals or work towards your goals. And for this last section here, you can kind of grab things from your goals to-do list that I mentioned earlier. Now, do this every day, do your goal check-in every week, and keep on adjusting and doing your systems. And I guarantee you'll be able to accomplish any goal you want to achieve. Now, go and conquer the world. If you're interested in seeing more of my content, click here. Otherwise, bye-bye.